Call of Duty Vanguard is getting a free alpha this weekend. The first images from the live action Cowboy Bebop film have been released and the PlayStation 5 is getting a new model, sorta. My name is Devontae Chisholm and you're watching GameSpot News. After being officially revealed last week, PlayStation players will have the first opportunity to try out the next entry in the Call of Duty franchise titled Vanguard. Starting on August 27th at 10 a.m. Pacific and 1 p.m. Eastern, anyone with a PlayStation 4 or 5 can download an alpha for the game, complete with the debut of a new game mode called Champion Hill. According to the announcement post, Champion Hill pits multiple squads against each other in a round robin tournament on a large map that's split into five sections. During the Call of Duty Vanguard Alpha, squads will be limited to two or three members, but larger games with more players may be included during a beta or when the game launches. According to that same post, players will have access to some of the game's arsenal and even be able to customize weapons with up to 10 attachments. PlayStation owners will also be able to play without PlayStation Plus. The alpha will end August 29th at 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern, and players who are eager to hop in can preload it starting today. Two other betas are currently scheduled for the game as well, with a beta for PlayStation owners who have pre-ordered the game, set to take place September 10th to 13th. And if you're really excited for Vanguard, make sure you check out our impressions video up on the site right now. Richie and Aaron got a chance to look at extended gameplay and I'll tell you all about it. But in other PlayStation related news, Sony has updated the PlayStation 5's design. However, the changes are so subtle, you may have never noticed them. The Australian site Press Start noticed the models in the wild, followed by Eurogamer finding them in the UK. According to those reports, the new model is roughly 0.6 pounds lighter than the original PS5 model. Though it's unclear what Sony may have changed about the production to account for the weight difference. The more noticeable change from a consumer angle is the addition of a thumb screw, so you can adjust the stand by hand, whereas the previous model required a screwdriver. But okay, Netflix's live action adaptation of the hit anime Cowboy Bebop is coming to the streaming service on November 19th. With this announcement of the premiere date, Netflix has also released images from the show as well. And they look surprisingly good. I mean, it's refreshing considering Netflix's past live action anime adaptations. In the first images of Spike, played by John Cho, we see the character has his signature blue suit with yellow shirt underneath. And yes, the headphones are there as well. The original anime followed a group of bounty hunters who are, according to the official synopsis, quote, on the run from their past as they hunt down the solar system's most dangerous criminals. They'll even save the world for the right price. I for one am really excited about this. I'm gonna wait for a trailer to get like super hyped about it, but Cowboy Bebop was one of the first animes to really get me into anime, so I'm curious. I, I, wanna, I wanna see how this goes. But all right, that's it for me. Make sure you let me know if you're excited for the Vanguard out for this weekend. Stay tuned to the channel because we'll be streaming it on Friday. And for more, subscribe to GameSpot on YouTube or visit us at GameSpot.com.